Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Yeah. She doesn't want me to film. Basically, she doesn't want to do anything. Isn't it? Mm -hmm. She doesn't want to do anything. Just gonna stand in front of the camera and show off your um, not combed hair. I actually need to take out the braids. My husband did it normally. I don't know how to do hair, like seriously. Anyway, welcome back to my channel. My name is Athena. If you're new here or if you don't know who I am, yeah, that, my name is Athena. Yeah, I'm from, I'm not from Greece, I'm from Cyprus. So I have a Greek name. But we are all Greeks in Cyprus. Not all, not all of us, but we are Greek. I'm Greek Cypriot anyway, so yeah. And we speak the same language but in a different accent if you're asking because a lot of people are so i just feel like i'm just gonna throw it out there but anyway yes in today's video um i've been wanting to do this video in a long time i'm currently pregnant i'm 20 i'm 26 weeks today i'm 26 weeks and i can't um comprehend how I'm gonna manage with two kids but yeah I'll still get pregnant anyway so yeah anyway in today's video I want to show you give me one sec okay okay I'm back I guess um, I'm sure I'm gonna be interrupted again but um, you know that's that but anyway today I wanted to um, show you a few pieces of clothing that i wear while i'm pregnant i never buy maternity clothes because a they're ugly and b why would i spend money on you know something that i wear just for like not even nine months you know you get bigger after you're like uh 20 you know 23 weeks even now i'm not that big i mean uh just don't get fat as well like that's a suggestion i mean you will get big especially on the belly bar try and maintain your weight because after birth it's very hard to lose the weight that you no know, to lose the pregnancy weight so yeah anyway uh by the way i'm not trying to body shame or fat shame anyone but it's just good for your health not to gain too much weight um, and during pregnancy, I had a lot of junk, to be honest, and I get mad with myself because I had too much junk that I shouldn't be eating, you know, I should be eating healthier. And I guess I'm just lucky I never gain much weight, so I can't body shame anyone because food is nice, food is good, and it's just so hard to not eat it. You know what I mean? You know what? That's, my daughter is playing with my patients. You see what I mean? We have a toddler. You're just praying that you wake up one day and there won't be toddlers anymore. But yeah. Um. But I love my daughter. Don't don't get me wrong. I'm just you know I'm just I'm just struggling. Everyone had everyone has their struggles, their personal struggles and i guess i just my struggle is that i'm not as patient you know with my toddler as i should and i don't love playing with her i mean you know you see some moms they love they enjoy so much playing with their kids with their toddlers and they will like my sister she has a thousand of toys with you know for her son and she she would teach him this and that and she would take him here and there and I just I just know me I'm trying to be like that but I just I'm not like I've got my limitations because I need my own time as well because I feel so consumed by everyday tasks of life in general and I just can't be you know they're attentive 
for my toddler all the time and I feel bad and guilty for that but it's just a struggle just personal struggle but anyway well what what was I even saying and, and yeah anyway I wanted to talk about clothing and you don't have to spend a bunch of money on uh, pregnancy wear and stuff like that you don't even have to I even with my first pregnancy with Iris I did not buy any maternity clothes the only thing that I had was actual maternity clothes it was jeans and my sister gave it to me just to wear at work and I barely wore it anyway because it was just uncomfortable yeah. it's so important to feel comfortable in your skin even when you're pregnant and it's so important to feel to still feel pretty to still feel beautiful and all those kind of things because pregnancy is hard is is it's hard enough yeah pregnancy is hard enough and if you don't um spend time to feel pretty and cute this is why while i'm pregnant <laughs> okay can you can you see her coughing because she wants to show you that she's coughing okay I don't know where this video is going. I might have a part two because um, I'm just getting distracted by my <laughs> toddler. Iris, being. Stop turning this around. People will see that the house is messy. Yeah, anyway. Iris, <laughs> this is when I get triggered, right? This is where I get triggered and I'm just, you know, like, um, okay. Iris, you see why I was away from you for so long? Because I just can't get anything done. My total is all my attention, as you can see. But anyway, as I was saying, when you're pregnant, especially when I'm pregnant, I invest a lot on skincare products for some reason, you know. Um, or I go and do my hair. Last time I chopped my hair, uh, this time I just... Um, I just colored it I guess a little bit and I let it grow and um, and also for the first time I got some hair products I never wear any hair products I'm just a masochist masochist that I love torturing myself while I'm brushing my hair because my hair is just so thin that it gets so tangled and I'm kind of forced to get hair products because I need to do hair hair and uh yeah i've been looking for some product to you know help me brush her hair because also she won't see it still for me to brush her hair she'll be crying it's just a very hard time as i was saying yes when i'm pregnant i tend to shop a lot and to get skincare products stuff like that so there are a few things that i like to wear when i'm pregnant that i still wear after my pregnancy as well as i tell i want to show you oh these are the best like uh they are leggings but um they've got this texture i've shown these leggings before they've got the seams here that make it kind of more formal um so you can wear it you know on a day out and on a night out and stuff like that not only during the day you can see wear it during the day and they are flare leggings and they're just amazing they're stretchy they stay in place you know they don't go like some cheap cheap leggings they are no see-through i just love them they are from george asda I've got those leggings in size 12 which i wear them now that i'm pregnant just to give myself a bit more even if I'm not pregnant, I will wear them in size 12, even in, in size 10. They're just a bit more high-waisted in a size 12. Because I love those leggings, I had to buy them, you know, I had to buy them again. They are very cheap, like £14 from Asda. Super cheap, I will link down below it, uh, uh, if they're still on stock. I know you ladies are struggling to find clothes to go out. So what do you do? When you say you have nothing to wear, you just go all black, really. So I've got what I usually do, 
especially now that it's spring I will wear these leggings with the um, a very stretchy <laughs> uh, bodysuit because otherwise you won't be able to wear it but this one still fits me so I wear this it's a polo uh, you know it has a kind of turtleneck and uh, no sleeves so I wear them together and I also I love this and I also throw a jacket on top I love this this is the perfect color for um, spring is not this pinkish you know it's not pink, too pinkish and it's not too red it's just a nice bright um, red color I would say similar to my head but as well yeah and um, yeah you've got you've got a an outfit like you don't need much you know you can see if you're cute and also you don't always uh, you don't always have to wear heels to look good on a night out um, I'm sure you won't go clubbing loud sounds are not loud sounds are not even good for the baby so you can um, I guess you prefer something calmer when you're pregnant I will assume so I will just go with some trainers some unique nice trainers and make sure you clean them don't wear dirty trainers I don't know why people wear dirty trainers why would you let your trainers get so dirty nah you have to look after your trainers sorry but I love trainers so you have to look after trainers okay so that's my newest addition to my trainers collection and I love it it has the same color with this lovely spring color you can also wear it on a night out I mean why not another thing that I love when I'm pregnant um, you know anything stretchy really during pregnancy it is suitable so bodycon dresses leggings I live in my leggings that's another uh, pair of good leggings where are they yes that I got recently is Everlast I love this faded color they are so super stretchy and they also keep everything nice and tight in place even the leggings I'm wearing now are very comfortable I've been wearing them for years they are from Fabletics Fabletics have some nice options as well when it comes to leggings and leggings I mean who doesn't love leggings this one I could just wear this one with this top and I'm sorted and, and love some nice trainers and you have a look I mean what else can you ask good quality leggings um, it's a key as well to, to look put together and cute don't go for the cheap ones that they are see-through and there's so many leggings and brands and this and that just do your own research find what you like find what looks good on you wear them and you don't even have to wear maternity leggings at that point I guess even with my first pregnancy as I said um, I didn't have to oh I also have another pair of leggings that I've let me show you these leggings is from how do you say it something Halula or Hulula or Halara <laughs> Halara yeah so basically these leggings as you can see they are crossed at the front you see this band it will allow you when you get bigger to yeah to wear them still even when your belly is very very big it's a good choice to wear when it comes to leggings because you it will grow with you basically and I'm not too keen on this brand it's not perfect quality but at least they are not see-through the only thing that they don't they keep rolling that's the only thing that, that I don't like it keeps rolling down and I find it annoying but apart from that it's nice it has some side pockets you can put your phone it's um it's not see-through and I have another pair in black and yeah they are great 
Okay, another thing I love while I'm pregnant is um, elasticated stuff. It can't be skirts, it can't be anything, anything that's elasticated and especially white leg trousers. So I've been showing these pants on my videos for like ages now. Hear me, they're, they are so nice. They look so nice on you. White leg leggings can really make you look taller and more, I don't know, they're just nice. And the satin as well of these pants, they're great. Unfortunately, I don't think they're selling that anymore. It's from Debenhams. I don't think they're selling that to be honest. Um, but we'll have a look. And if I can find nice alternatives, I will link them down below. And yeah, elasticated. Um, it doesn't need to be at the front, the elastic, because it will look cheap. But at the back is a great solution when you're pregnant because when you grow, it will allow you as well to grow without suffocating you basically. And that's a very good choice. Again, for a night out, for a more formal event. And I've got a matching top that I love. Again, elasticated, I told you, anything elasticated, you need to wear it during your pregnancy you know things that expand is a great solution when you are pregnant uh, yeah i love this top as well i've got it in pink as well for mango i don't think they have it anymore it wasn't sale as well another cute outfit put to you look put together and you're yeah, good to go i also have another one another lyrex i love lyrex uh -huh. Anyway, next next item that I love wearing, as I said before, bodycon, bodycon dresses. Again, they expand with you. Even if I'm 40 weeks, this one it will still suit me. Even when I'm 40 weeks, I'm sure. And they are so nice. This is from French Connection. It's a lovely, thick, nice knit bodycon dress so nice and classy so yeah bodycon dresses bodycon skirts if that's your type if that's what you like you need to you need to have in your wardrobe and next next thing you need to have in your wardrobe is oversized everything like oversized t-shirts as you can see oversized 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 shirts you know um especially at the beginning some people they are not very comfortable to show that they are pregnant so oversized things are a great way to hide your belly even at work um when we used to not wear uniform i used to wear so many oversized things so patients at work wouldn't know I'm pregnant until very later when I was proper like showing but oversized things is another good solution for you if you love dresses get some oversized dresses you know um, if you love hoodies I love hoodies you know oversized hoodies oversized um, sweatshirts I love oversized sweatshirts um, joggers as well I wear joggers especially on my first pregnancy because it was um, during lockdown and everyone was at home and all these uh, jogger sweatpants trends were, was everywhere so I was wearing a lot of sweatpants so um, but now I'm not feeling it that much I still wear sweatpants but I prefer leggings now for some reason I don't know <sighs> I'm running out of breath but yeah sweat sweatshirt sweat or bucky sweatshirts bucky t-shirts if that's your vibe they, 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 they look very cool you know i love it like you can never go wrong with oversized things especially if you want to hide your belly at the beginning of your pregnancy okay last but not least thing that i love to wear while i'm pregnant is crop tops or crop this is a crop um like lounge top 
loungewear top as you can see not too tight but it's tight enough to keep everything secure i hate wearing bras now of course because it gets in bigger so the wire under the bra you can feel it so what i normally wear is either sports bra or crop tops like this one i've got this for years that's from zara and that's the newest addition in my uh, crop top collection you can wear them as bras because it gets so uncomfortable like so i wear my crop tops and they, they still look cute so you still feel cute when you wear them and um without feeling the discomfort of a normal bra so you can wear i guess there might be suitable maternity bras which i don't want to spend money on i don't think it's necessary and um and sports bra is also a great solution so yeah that's um that's yeah that's what that's what anyway yeah that's a few items that i wear clothing items that i wear while i'm pregnant and they keep me you know they they, they keep me feeling secure and comfortable and still cute of course you still need to look cute when you're pregnant and it's so important especially when your hormones are all over the place you want to feel put together at times you know it will boost it boost your confidence your all that so some these are some of the solutions some of the clothes are where a good solution for when you're pregnant without having to spend money on maternity clothes and yeah thanks so much for watching if you watch to here i appreciate you and thank you so much for watching and uh this really helps my channel grow bit by bit and if you like my headband head over to my etsy shop to purchase is uh, a new newest it's a newest product it's a newer newer product and um super cute as you can see very cute so if you like it check the link down below i'm gonna link my etsy shop the description box down below as always and i will see you next time please like and subscribe i will see you soon bye all night long yeah we dance with our raising tongues and all day long